in the last week, 20 scientists from Institute Pasteur and other research institutions in Madagascar were trained in DNA sequencing using nanopore sequencing. Nous avons une collection de souches à l'Institut Pasteur qui euh, avoisine les 9000 souches. Et depuis quelques années, nous avons pensé à élargir et à renforcer nos capacités de, 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 de typage de souches euh, depuis l'avènement des, euh, des, euh, des séquençages complets de génome. For a long time, the industry and academia have developed products and techniques in microbiology that are not amenable to field conditions that we face here, where the TB patients actually are. This week, we are moving out of a controlled environment to a peripheral laboratory where we will try to achieve old genome sequencing of mycobacterium tuberculosis in a point of care setting for the first time. We've moved into the field now at the General Hospital here and we are testing out our DNA extraction protocol. Yesterday we extracted the DNA from the patient sputum samples and now today we are sequencing the DNA on the nanopore technology. Our work here has proven that it is possible to sequence DNA directly from patient samples in remote areas such as Madagascar. To achieve tuberculosis elimination, um, we know for a fact that we will need to do better than what we've done so far. Conventional approaches um, that focus on supervising uh, drug administration are just not enough and we need better tools. In the last years, we acknowledged as a TB community that this bug is actually as good as any other bug in developing ingenious resistance mechanisms to all the drugs that we've rolled out so far. And we need to better understand these mechanisms if we want to tailor our interventions.